Uh, it's been a rather different day at the office for one member of the RAF. Corporal Jason Bomber Wood was recently part of a winning team at an inter-services cooking competition. Part of his prize was a taste of the action at a top Mayfair restaurant, courtesy of the celebrity chef Richard Corrigan. Julie Knox has the story's ingredients. <laughs> Bomber, who's been a chef in the RAF for 25 years, is being served his just desserts and getting the chance to spend some off-duty time in this kitchen. I competed in RAF Senior Chef of the Year and uh, I was awarded gold best in class for my whole meal. But as uh, for my dessert, uh, Richard awarded me uh, outstanding dish of the whole competition and as a small prize for that, he offered me a day's work experience and dinner at his expense uh, in the restaurant uh, the following day. It's work experience without too much pressure, giving him an insight into the pace and practices of an elite restaurant. Bomber has been uh, doing, uh, he's been working with my head chef Chris, uh, he's been uh, doing a lot of boning, boning and dressing and uh, cleaning this morning, uh, I mean on the butcher's block, he's been watching service today, I think he's surprised how quickly and how busy it all is. Uh, he's done a great job, you know, he hasn't let himself down, that's for sure. I mean, most people come in here and they hide in the corner. Bummer got completely stuck in there, boning out all the chickens and everything, so well done him. I'm sorry about steak and kidney pie, medium rare, so much. And he's found it more cramped than his spacious kitchen at RAF Cottesmore and a lot faster paced. Plus, there's serious money at stake when the place has a Michelin-starred chef, unlike in a military mess. Obviously, the, the customers that we provide for don't pay quite the same money that they pay for when they come to a restaurant like this. It's great to see the next generation of chefs in the military and out here in the restaurant business as well. I can always compare. I'm always looking for new ideas. I'm always looking for new ways of operating. So I'm quite nosy. So they're all picking up new dish ideas from each other. Julie Knox, Forces News.